Aloha, internet type people. We are on our way to another National Trust place. Cuts got up early, did my TLC work, worked my website, which is almost done. Very excited to show all of you. And so, got the National Trust pass, might as well be using it. So there's one that's like 30 minutes away. It's great. You took the thing last time. Let's check if we have them first. But that's where we're going and it's gonna be another good day of that. Then we're gonna come home, maybe some Lego Star Wars, work on work and my website more. Good day. I'll show you this uh, other England cool place monument thing. It'll be good. We have come to Wait Rose, which is just a posh supermarket, like Whole Foods, like Safeway. I don't know. Just to get some little picnicky things like a sandwich each to go to the National Trust place and eat there because saving money is fun. Well, we drove about 45 minutes, got to the place, they're closed on Wednesdays and Sundays. Nothing said that they, that so very surprising. Well, good thing we have the National Trust app now, so we just said what's near us and it gave us another direction, another location. So that is where we're headed now. <sighs> Silly. I'm coloring them. Of course I am, let's be honest. Hey, we're here. Yeah, I guess this is just a garden. What? <laughs> just a garden. I love gardens. I'm very excited. We just walked through the entrance area and holy buckets. Lovely so far. Well, I've almost ate it because I forgot to film, but I got a quinoa pea and goat cheese. Feta, no, feta and lemon quinoa salad. Really good. Come on, look at the barn with like a thatched roof and building poo. I mean, even the toilet building is a little cute barn. There's a pond with lilies in it. This is just one part of the garden. Apparently every part of the garden is like a room and they're all different. And then here's a greenhouse. Yeah, Lawrence Johnson just uh, grew some thistles and just kind of was like, let it grow wherever it wants to. Let it grow. Let it grow. <laughs> <laughs> Can't stop my plants anymore. Vern the vegan, I found your heaven. This whole area is vegetables of things to pull. Here's some kale. You could just come here and eat. You could just ah and roll on the ground and fill yourself up for a day or two. Like a whale. This is not a joke. This is what I want to do as well. Yeah, you could just be a you could be a plant whale. Just lay and just ar, 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 everything around you. We found asparagus. I've never seen asparagus grow. I feel really dumb on agriculture. I'm so sorry, Nebraska. I did not do well, but you guys can't grow half of this stuff there because well maybe you can. There's just not enough rain. But seriously, like this is what you eat and it looks so strange growing. I want to eat it all though. It's I like want Farmville. Oh, I saw. It's like Farmville. <laughs> Prince Johnson, you cool kid. You also had a tennis court just in your garden. Oh, Luke, is there another racket? Yeah. Cuz there's a ball. That's what we're going to go play. We're definitely playing. Okay, so I'm actually sweating and out of breath from playing tennis. So that proves how much working out I've done here and how much tennis I've played in my life. Both of those are zero. Um, one time I tried to play tennis and I left the, because I was so frustrated with how awful I was at it. I mean, I was like seven. I mean, I probably would still do that now though because I hate it. But guess what we found now? Croquette! And so because Luke's British, he knows the rules, which are? Get the ball through each hoop mm -hmm. with one of these. Mm -hmm. A flamingo? Before the other person does it. And of course, it is not a complete day in England without seeing sheep in a field. That would just be preposterous. Of course there are sheep everywhere you look. It's England. This part of the garden has lots of water around it and it's just completely huge and bushy. Hello. Hello. <laughs> you got the right photo. Yes, getting good, good pictures. And video, but she doesn't need to know. She doesn't want to, she doesn't know old Turner. But this took a bit to find. It's the pillar garden. It's like 
something out of Alice in Wonderland. Look at all the flowers in there. It's very, very cool. Good place to play hide and seek. Oh, cool. This is neat. It's a little cube, a rectangle of trees. This part, garden's cool. There's a sundial, which is off. And Luke is very upset with sundials nowadays. Once he's found out they're a complete hocus pocus. Is that, what are your thoughts about sundials, Luke? They're useless like 80% of the time. You know what I realized, Luke? I don't think I ever said the name of this place. We're at Hidcote. Hidcote. Hidcote Gardens. Made by Lawrence Johnston. Look at all the trees. Look how cool that smooth looking topiary bush thing is. Me and this matching striped woman. And there's these little hedges. Hey, come around and look. It's a pond. I love it. How fun would it be to have this little hideaway in your garden? Look at the like murals of croquet. We are now in Stratford upon Avon. Been here a couple times now. Um, just to walk around because it's a nice area and it wasn't too far from where we were. And go get a chicken drink, maybe a cidre. Uh, not Stella Cedre, just a cider. Just said it that way for God knows what reason. Look at all these buildings. Behind here is a garden that Luke wanted to show me because behind here, what happened over over here, Luke? I was walking along this wall. Scars, my Jackass inspired DVD that I made with my friends. <laughs> I was supposed to fall off this way, the wall's about this high. I was supposed to fall off this way and pretend to be hurt, and somebody was supposed to come and help me. I fell the other way, and it's about a 20 foot drop, and it snapped my ankle bone in two. That's it. I had to call an ambulance. Wow. Just couldn't walk. So, what was supposed to be a fake injury mm. ended up being very real. Um, this bar has the absolute coolest back garden. Jack. Well, well, well. Look what we got, Mr. Jones. A pitcher, not a cup, a pitcher of Pims. This is the other side of it. Look how nice it is. Oh, look how cute the little buildings are. Well, looks like from now on I'm just never going to end a vlog on the right day and just finish it the next morning because that's the, that's what's been happening. So yesterday we went to Stratford Pine Haven and saw that. Then we decided to stop at Luke's parents on the way home and we were there. And... <laughs> Luke's dad gave me a cider and I drank the whole thing. So I was like, oh yeah, like I'll have a cider. After I drank it, I was like, wow, okay, that was a cider. And I looked at the bottle, it was 8.3% alcohol. I was like, oh, okay. So that was fun yesterday. Then we got back home. I'm ending the vlog now and it is the next morning. It's early, it is 7 a.m. And Luke and I are gonna go do something very exciting today. So check out tomorrow's vlog and you'll see what we're doing. See you tomorrow, bye.